An outspoken and critical Ugandan policeman has been assassinated, a police spokesman said Sunday, in the latest in a series of murders of senior officers and politicians. Mr. Mohamed Kairou Mira and his female companion were attacked near his home in Balunga, Wakiso district on Saturday. The Uganda police force is greatly concerned with the assassination of Assistant Superintendent of Police Mohamed Kairou Mira at Balunga last night, police spokesman Emily Nkema said. He was with a lady whom we have been informed is not his wife but someone he knew, and she too succumbed to bullet wounds in the hospital where she was rushed for treatment. Mr. Kema added that the assailants were reportedly traveling on a motorcycle, a tactic used in the killings of Assistant Inspector General of Police Andrew Koisi in March as well as a senior public prosecutor in 2015, and others. Mr. Kairu Mira was a tough critic of Mr. Gail Kahura, the former police boss. He had said he was living in fear after being threatened with death. He was suspended from his role as district commander in January after accusing his colleagues in a Facebook post of corruption and working with criminal gangs. Shortly after he was arrested when heavily armed police forced their way into his house as he holed up resisting detention in an operation that took over five hours. Mr. Kairou Mira was awaiting trial on charges of criminal misconduct and abuse of authority at the time of his death. A police disciplinary court had in May recommended his demotion from assistant superintendent of police to assistant inspector of police. Police disciplinary court chairman Dennis Odongpani found him guilty of abuse of authority contrary to section 441 and 24A of the Uganda Police Code. In his judgment, Mr. Odongpani noted that during Mr. Kairu Mira's tenure as the officer in charge of Nansna Police Station, he and other police officers under his command went to the home of Keitsi Kamada of Nansna West 2, Nakhal Zone in Wakiso District, on April 19, 2014 and ordered his wife to vacate and relocate to another area, which was not under his mandate. In March this year, President Yoweri Museveni fired the chief of police as well as the country's security minister in what was seen as a reaction to growing insecurity in the country. In June this year ruling party lawmaker Ibrahim Mabiraiga was gunned down alongside his brother. No one has been brought to book for any of the killings.